Okay, this is the last day of orientation where we have to wear business casual. And at this point, my blisters are so bad on my feet, so I'm literally wearing sneakers. My roommate gave me these because she works for this company. Well, let me show you, I got my badge. Maybe I should cover this part. Here it is, looking official. We got the little thingy. So I'm officially a student now. I'm not gonna lie, I've been pretty anxious this whole week. I feel like there's a lot of energy and everyone's trying to meet each other, which is super fun, but also I'm so exhausted and it's just a big, lifestyle change for me. I haven't been in school in two years and it's not that long, but still, I feel like there's so much new information being thrown at us and there's so many new people to meet. It's a little overwhelming, but I know that with time, everything will like settle. surfed this morning and I always feel so like calm and happy afterwards. Orientation week happened. This is currently Saturday. I didn't vlog that much just because it was pretty hectic um, and I was very nervous and anxious but I think it went really well. Everyone in my class is so sweet. There's 144 of us and so far everyone I've talked to has been super nice. I feel like I kind of have to put myself out there because I don't live with any dental students and I live a little further from campus, but honestly, so far it's been fine. I'm just trying to like soak it all in and enjoy it. I'm just so happy to be in dental school and working towards something that makes sense to me. And I think my gap years were very necessary. Like I grew so much from them. lectures are over and I'm heading over to do some homework so I'm wearing my scrubs jumpsuit and I feel like it's so cute this is the first time I've worn it so I don't know I feel like it's so fun that it's all just like one connected piece also update I got a rug it still needs to be like flattened out and also I still need a couch but this is what we're working with it's starting to feel like a home starting to settle in and I'm just excited to be on a routine now. I already want to get this in other colors because having a jumpsuit on is so like easy. I'm about to get brunch with my home friends from Seattle. I haven't seen some of them in years, so super excited. Also, we're going to Elefante, which is so basic, but I love it so much, so stoked. Although I've never got to Elefante for brunch, so we'll see what the food's like. Ignore how crusty I look right now, but I'm taking photos. 
of an incisor for a dental morphology assignment. I'm trying to get a photo of the incisal edge. So, yeah, just having a photo shoot with some teeth. I got more blood drawn. This is the last time hopefully I have to do that. And then I picked up a strawberry matcha. I think I'm gonna spend the rest of the day at home just doing readings and doing some assignments. So I figured that this would be like my midday treat. I've spent the entire day sitting here with these. My back hurts. I am way too familiar with incisors. It's time to go to bed. I just showered after my run. I have one more lecture online today and then I'm gonna go back so drilling homework. We're halfway into week one right now and I feel like I'm settling a bit. Um, orientation week was pretty hectic. Beginning of this week was pretty hectic. I was still trying to figure out like where everything is, the deadlines and also like what needs to be done first. Which is obviously just part of like Hi, I'm getting ready to go to a wine bar and I don't know what to wear. I feel like the temperature is like changing, so it's kind of awkward. For homework this week, my homework is to go into the lab and practice drilling out different shapes on the block. And I think that's so cool that that gets to be my homework. I'm just so happy to be in this new chapter of my life. I just feel like a person again. I think working in hospitality something from me and like my sense of personhood so honestly next time you go to any place of business especially like a restaurant or a cafe where you interact with someone please be nice to them because they're it's hard but anyways we're over let me show you my outfit okay so this tiktok is from la This skirt I got from a flea market in, I want to say it was the Melrose flea, maybe. And then these boots are Revolve. I feel like boots just make me feel, I don't know. I'm 
I'm gonna do a Sephora haul. I'm actually really excited. I feel like I haven't bought much from Sephora in a long time. It was my birthday last week, so this is I'm trying to this is my present to myself. I got brow gel. This is just clear brow gel. Okay, I got this loose powder. It's the mini version because the full size is $60 and powder takes so long for me to go through anyway, so I would never get through that entire thing. The lady who was helping color match me, she kind of called me out. She was like, you have a lot of red. Okay, she didn't say a lot. I would recommend the one with green in it to cancel it out. I was like, okay, you know what? You're right, I do have redness and that's fine. Then I got a pot concealer because I normally use like the one that comes in a tube, but I feel like I want one to cover my acne scars because I have a lot of them. This was kind of an impulse buy, but I owned this maybe a year ago and then I dropped it and it shattered and I was so sad. It just like makes your skin look really smooth and I have acne, so my skin is never smooth. The last thing I bought is this. I don't know how to say this brand. Ole Henriksen. The only reason I bought this is because Suni Lee dropped her lip combo on TikTok and during the Olympics, her makeup looks so good. She's so talented and so beautiful. Okay, I'm ending the vlog here. I'm heading to lab now wearing a lot of pink, um, but thank you for watching all this way. Thanks for listening to me yeah, for like 15 minutes. Um, I'm loving dental school so far. I'm very overwhelmed and I think it's gonna be a long road ahead, but I'm also super excited for it. So thanks for coming along on this journey with me and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.